You know what it is, you know who it is, Nick Fury back with another video, and I am back with a cop or nah Black Friday edition, giving you news and information about Black Friday sales coming up next week. But before we get into the video, like, subscribe, and after you subscribe, hit the bell icon so you get notifications when I release content in the future. Let's get into the sales. Starting with Nintendo, if you are looking for a discounted Nintendo Switch, you're going to have no such luck. Obviously, Nintendo is not looking to have a sale on the Switch. They're going to sell it at full price due to the popularity of the console. But as I mentioned in the previous Copper Nom, there is going to be an Ocarina of Time 2DS for $79.99. And there's going to be an Explorer's Edition of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild sold at regular price. This will include a 100 page Explorer's Guide, uh, posters, things like that. So it's a good collector's item if you are into The Legend of Zelda. Other than that, there aren't very many Switch sales. They're going to have some Switch bundles and they're going to have some games discounted for cheap none of the main first party titles I can see are for sale uh, they have some mentions here Lego City Undercover Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 Ultra Street Fighter 2 things like that uh, for cheap but other than that that's really all you're gonna get from Nintendo on Black Friday some 3DS sales but I'm not interested in 3DS I want to talk about the switch and Nintendo is being very stingy with the switch right now so on to Microsoft if you think you're going to find a discounted Xbox One X, much like the Switch, you are out of luck. There is no sales on the Xbox One X, only bundle packages, but the Xbox One S will be on sale for $189.99 for a bundle. Microsoft doesn't specify what bundle it is. They just say that it's going to be a bundle. Um, it's safe to assume that the model is going to be a 500 gigabyte base model and probably $50 more to add an additional 500 gigabytes to make it one terabyte. Uh, games like Forza Motorsport 7, Gears of War 4, Halo Wars, and Forza Horizon 3 are going to be $20 off their standard price. Um, you can get $20 off on select Xbox wireless controllers, $15 off on headsets, and $10 for a three month or six month subscription to Xbox Live. Uh, just to add this for a bonus for Cyber Monday, it is rumored that Microsoft will have Xbox One S's in a bundle with Destiny 2, uh, Minecraft, and some Forza game for $199 for Cyber Monday, and also an Xbox One X for $450 with Forza. That would be Forza 7, of course. So look out for those sales on Cyber Monday if this is true. When it comes to Sony, there will be no sales on the PlayStation 4 Pro, just sales on the regular PlayStation 4. This is kind of surprising to me. The PS4 Pro has been out for a while. You would think to boost sales to compete with the Xbox One X and the Switch, they would have a bundle for the PS4 Pro, but they don't. But the PlayStation 4 will be $200 for a 500 gigabyte model. And what also surprises me is that they are marking down their VR bundles, uh, but they're not marking down and or having a bundle for the PS4 Pro. In the PS4 Pro, we know they made for VR, so I don't know what their game is or what the end game is here with the Black Friday sales, but you can get the Gran Turismo Sport Bundle for $299.99, and then you can get the Skyrim VR Bundle uh, for $349.99. So there you have it. Those are your big sales for Black Friday coming up next week. Me, personally, I'm probably just going to go ahead and go to GameStop and get the buy two get one free just for my Nintendo Switch and maybe some other uh, Xbox games and honestly I can't get over the fact that the PS4 Pro isn't in a bundle or for sale um, if it would have been for sale I might have been very very uh, convinced or very tempted to purchase one but now it's all for none I'm not going to so there you have it the Black Friday the big Black Friday sales I guess you can call them big Black Friday sales for next week let me know in the comments what you think will you be picking some of these up yes no nah whatever remember it is all about gaming it is all about what you make of gaming and not choosing a side this has been Nick Fury and I will see you guys later